Hey, we're back, and Tim's gonna try to not die again. Let's try that again with more power. And less failure. Six flags, what? No, never mind. <clears throat> so this time, instead of shooting the dude who does all of the squats in the butt, throw a thermal detonator. I like that idea. Let's do that. Still, still knock the first dude out, because reasons, and he's standing there asking for it. He's like, yeah, that's the way I like it. That's the way I like it. I'm taking a nap. Now, you guys, you guys... Thermal debt. You guys can have fun with this. That's for you! Yay! You had fun! Too bad. That's a dead scout trooper. Oh, hi. That's a dead stormtrooper. Oh, hi, Mark. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hi, Mark. <laughs> who, who, where where you come from? Go away. Where did you come from? Where did you go? Where did you come from? Stormtrooper Joe. Bee bee ba ba da ba da do. I hope that's gonna kill someone. Hey! Oh, pa! <laughs> that waveform. <laughs> hey! Hey! Go away, you guys! You guys? You guys are bad guys. You're bad at me. They're not bad. You're the traitor. <laughs> Hey, you know, he was the one that was just phasing through a fence, so I think that's pretty mean. That's cheating. It's not, it's not being mean. It's that's being cheating. mean. That's, like, I don't think the fence was amenable to that. Does the fence have an opinion? I don't know. I'm just, I'm just guessing. I'm making a guesswork. Why did you, why, why are you having a barbecue up there? I didn't give you permission. Does he need your permission to have a barbecue? I don't know. Boom! Right in the chin. Boom! Right in the chin. Power. Boom! Right it's in the chin. Oh boy, it's friends down there. You can you can maybe barrage does. I can probably take cover. Oh, you don't have own. the you didn't pick up the barrage. Crap on a dolphin. I'd rather not. <laughs> uh, uh, da, 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 cut bat beam beam. You're gonna go back for the barrage. I'm going back for burrs. Okay, so barrage cut. Beam beam burrs. So I'll just I'll just cut it after I say you don't have the barrage, and then like fast forward to getting the barrage and coming back. <laughs> Barrage for me. Thank you. I don't think I should go up there. That's where the ATST was. The ATST. Yeah, that one. That one. The ATMP3. ATMP SD. Deep dope. Deep dope. Deep dope. Deep up. 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 There you go. Go up the thing and down the stairs. Up the stairs. Hey, hello, friends. Hello, friends. Hello, friends. Friends. Friends, Roman countrymen, lend me your plasma. I shot you in the ankle. How does that make you feel? Uh, probably not happy about things. Uh, too bad. You guys still here? Ba -ba 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 Hi, friend. Bye, friend. You hit him, sort of. Yee. Bagoosh. 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 Al bagoosh. Everything is bagoosh. Bagoosh! Oh, that officer wasn't even wearing armor. His insides are now outsides. <laughs> I feel kind of bad. Kind of, but not really. Okay, just looking for a right one. No, yeah. Seems like there's multiple pathways, but I'm not sure where There are, but they all go to the same target. Hijack the attack. Hijack? No, no, commandeer. That's for you guys. Nice. E. That's it. That's it. You grenade and one three-round burst. There you go. Damn. That's how you do the things. Let's commandeer this airboat. I mean, AT-AT. Same thing. Same thing. Yay! Oh, boy. Oh, boy. <laughs> oh, that's so cool. I wish you were using it against rebels on Hoth, but still cool. Too bad I'm using it against the bad guys. Shut up! Up! up. Oh, jump right! Eh, eh, there we go. There we go. That. Hey! Hey! Look! You got his attention. <laughs> <laughs> bang! Bang! Oh, there it is. <laughs> oh boy! Where's the giant walking thing? I can't find it. Bam! Bam! Up! Oh, over there. Bam! Up! Oh, I'm dead. Something doesn't seem right here. Because there's a fence? Question mark? No, they're they're like, why is an AT-AT shooting at us? Something doesn't seem right. This is supposed to be our friends. I missed. Yeah, you did. Let's try that again without not. Let's, let's try not doing that. Do you have an alternate fire, or is it just the giant cannons? I can zoom. I don't, don't think so. Tie. Tie. Like cuisine. Oh, right there. Oh, he's hovering. That's freaking cool. I've never seen them hover. I know they're capable of hovering. I have never seen one hover. How are you living through all of this? One shot. Yeah, that is actually kind of a good question. 
Because yeah. they're not shielded. They shouldn't be able to take an at, -AT shot to the chest. Yeah. Super confused. Super confused? Super. There's, there's an ATST right in front of you. Oh, well, there's also a sail like this. Well, it's targeting array, so shoot it in the mouth. Well, fine. I meant the targeting array, but, you know, ATST works too. I mean, that looks like it kind of has a mouth, so I guess it's true. Pew pew! Pew pew! Woo! That array has a lot of health! You got Maybe. yourself a red border going on here. It's, uh, it, it's built to resist orbital strikes, so I'm guessing, just guessing, it can take a couple of shots. <laughs> you think so? Hey, look, it's TIE Fighter. Oh, you were blending in. You are hidden very well, sir. Got the animal. You just shot the Corvus. Oh, well. Destroy okay. the barricade. Destroy that barricade! I mean, you could destroy the ATST while you're at it, but, you know. Yeah, alright. Semantics. AT-8? Oh, God! There's an, there's an enemy AT-8 Oh, that's wonderful. That's helpful. Oh, I shot him in the mouth. Let's, uh... Let's go ahead and, uh... Let's go ahead and, uh... Yeah. Let's go ahead and, uh... Blow you up, because we don't need you here. ATST, right in front of you. Uh, I can't... I can't aim at him. That's as far as I can turn. Let's go ahead and destroy the barricade, then. I'm not gonna get that we'll far without that. Nope, too bad. You guys can't get out. Too bad. Too bad. Too bad. You don't do that. fighter in front of you. Oh, thank you. Eto, it's sure. Yeah, it's aim a little bit lower in order to hit him. Kind of weird. Different perspective. Hey, you know what? If it works, it works. It works. Too bad. What's uh -oh. that? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I think we may- oh the, boy. the storm from the- from Project Cinder, um, is causing ion shorting. Hey, <laughs> just like on Hoth. Yeah, except they didn't use an ion cannon to knock out the AT-ATs on Hoth. That would have made things a lot easier. That would have been. But the only space. ion cannon they had was pointed towards space to shoot the- the Star Destroyers. Yeah, I'm, oh, it's too bad. I was I was commenting on the fact that it made the same almost the same position. Oh right. Well, I mean, it felt it pitched itself forward. So yeah. There's your point of comparison. <laughs> <laughs> hey yo, get down from there. Hey you, get off of that thing. I'm actually I think you're gonna agree with me on this. I'm really glad that that ATST stayed uh, stayed dead despite the fact you didn't kill it during the uh, during the AT AT portion. Yeah, I would not want to. Yeah, ATST behind you? Yeah, that'd be pretty sucky. That would win. Pretty sucky. Get shot. Thank you. See, you, you were like shooting the thin metal rail between his head and your plasma. Of course I would. You got really great accuracy for hitting the enemy. For, for hitting not the enemy. That's, that's what I do best, you know? That's what I do. I miss everything else. You now have a grenade launcher. That's wonderful, baby. Woo. Too bad. Too bad? Too bad. Oh, did you know I had to reload, pal? There you go. Oh, here we go. Because he's the AI. He knows everything. Hey, Pikachu? Because <laughs> I heard he knows everything, too. Oh, yeah. Pikachu knows everything. That reminds me. Um, Tim. Yo! Did you hear they're making a movie based on Detective Pikachu? I, I, I thought they, yeah, I, I thought they were going to do that. It's a game. I thought they were making a movie. They're making a movie? They're making a live action movie. Based um, on Detective Pikachu. Yeah, wasn't Danny DeVito supposed to be the voice of Pikachu? No! That was a petition, you fool. Oh. <laughs> it was a petition to get him to voice Pikachu in the American localization, which I don't think ever actually happened. Oh. So... That's unfortunate. You know what else very, is unfortunate? Very, very There's a friggin' AT-AT after us. However, it's a live-action movie, and I guess the lead role is being played by, uh, Justice Smith? Good name. <laughs> Nice! Oh, that's uh, Beth the, Terrible. The storm just took out the at, -AT for you. You're welcome! Thank you, storm. Oh man, I am loving this campaign so far, I gotta say. 
After everything that's happened, this is a kick-ass campaign. I mean, it's, it's pretty good. A lot better than the first game that came out. Great! More friends! More friends to shoot. Step. Somebody say something about Skywalker? No. <laughs> Scout Walker. Board the court of us. I like that idea. I like that idea with an ATSC crawling up my butt. They are shooting the crap out of your butt. Holy crap. Accomplished, sir. Congratulations, Commander. So, we're not completely alone. Some of the crew stayed with us, protected the refugees against those who wouldn't. How are they? Shaken, confused, but safe. Just want to know what's next. We have to warn people. Who? The rebels? They're just gonna toss us in sunspot prison before we can even say a word. That's why I think you should just take the Corvus and go. Leave me a TIE fighter. I'll set off a distress call, wait for the rebels to find me. <laughs> you really think I'm gonna let you just float out here alone? Del. We're Infernal Squad. You and me. This is Iden Versio of the Imperial Raider Corvus, sending a general distress call to the Rebel Alliance. We surrender. Contact the general now. So you thought it was a trap, but brought them on board anyway? You're always telling me to take risks. Seemed like the most irresponsible thing I could do. <laughs> that a boy. Hello. I'm General Lando Calrissian. You must be the Imperial defectors I've heard so much about. General, we've already told your people everything we know. Let's take a walk. What is this? A bad idea. To settle a bet, Strip thinks you're Imperial spies. What do you think? I think you're scared, running for your lives. Listen, you gave us good intel on Operation Cinder. In return, I've got two starfighters just for you. Wait, you're letting us leave? That's right, start a new life, find somewhere safe. Somewhere you can track us? We're too busy for that. We just got word that Operation Cinder is headed to Naboo. You have to stop it. I think we can handle it. You're wrong. The Empire's changing, and so are its tactics. If that's the case, why not come with us? Help save Naboo. We're not here to join your rebellion. No one's asking you to. This is a one-time deal. You can leave right now, 
Or you can help stop this. You really trust us to fight beside you? What can I say? I'm a big believer in second chances. Come on, I'll show you to your ships. We don't even know how to fly X-Wings. It should be easy for special forces. What's the alternative, I? So, what's it going to be? Some of these satellites. Not <laughs> that one. That's well, gone now. Oh, wait. They're, they're, follow the follow the icon. Follow the yellow brick hut. No, oh. follow the icon. Follow the yellow brick hut. Ugh. I'm gonna get, get away from that a little bit. Could get away from you. That's rude. Thanks, Carlo. I rude. didn't do nothing. Fucking <laughs> <laughs> you. Did you know Billy D. Williams was quite upset that they didn't in, uh, they didn't include him in episode seven? I could believe it. I'd, if I were Billy D. Williams, I'd be pissed. It's like we're doing more Star Wars. You didn't even ask me. Yeah. Wait, <laughs> really? <laughs> uh, my mom knows someone in his family. I'm not sure who, but she knows somebody in, from Billy D.'s family. And apparently, uh, he was quite upset over that. His goddaughter Julie. She was on Scrubs. You know, scrubs? <laughs> Never mind, it's a, it's a joke. <laughs> was it really though? It, it, yes, it, it was! It like could have actually been a thing. It's, okay, so the character that JD dates, whose name is Julie, in the Ugh. in the show, the when Billy D. Williams guest starred, he was his, he was Julie's godfather. That's the reference I was making, but oh, okay. apparently neither of you watched Scrubs enough to get it. <laughs> Not enough of it. <laughs> Whereas I have watched Scrubs, I think, nine-ish times? The whole thing? The, the whole series. Well, not, not med school. I didn't like the med school addendum that they made to the end of it. I thought it was crap. I've only watched uh, maybe a couple episodes a couple times, maybe? You know, I've watched I've watched a beginning... I've watched a beginning to end of season seven. So, like, the, what I thought was the official finale, nine-ish times. I thought you just destroyed the satellites. We did. It's after that piece of debris, guy. Go that way. Go this way. That way. Oh, there's more. There's more that way. Go get him. Okie dokie. And see, you're in X-Wings now. You don't have to worry about not having shields like in the TIE Fighter. Yeah. Because TIE Fighters don't have shields. They do not. They don't even have hyperdrives. They're short-range fighters. They can't go very far. Woo! You know, if this, uh, this were actually true to, uh... True to scale? True to life? True, true to, uh, okay. True to, uh, how sound works in space, this would not be as entertaining. Well, yeah, because you wouldn't hear anything. You'd just see stuff. Yeah. So there wouldn't be explosions? Well, the electricity, that, that fire wouldn't be happening, but, like, the electricity getting thrown off would still go. Yeah. You need oxygen for fire need, to exist. You need oxygen for fire. You don't need oxygen for electricity. Right. You don't need oxygen for plasma. Plasma. I was gonna say, the Empire's not really doing all that much to try to stop me, and now they are. <laughs> They're not doing much to stop me, you say, as you keep getting shot in the ass. Initially. 
Protect the Y-Wing Bombers! I can do that. Can you? I could. If I really put my, uh... Butt to it. That's not the word I was gonna use. It is, though. That's not the one. Time to walk. Crap, that's the wrong way. Good job. Oh, I gotta destroy these guys. I think I figured out who I have to, to destroy here. Come on, baby. Get some. Get some. Oh. Stop following. I love how you're flying upside down this entire time. And it's, you know, it's space. You can't really tell. Uh, there is a right way and a wrong way. Take out that interceptor. Oh, oh there it goes. Take out that TIE fighter. I intercepted the interceptor. Take out the TIE fighter, though. Okay. Do it! There it I goes. did it! You got more to shoot. I'm cool with that. I love this. Do you? I love this. This I is would. awesome. This is fun. We were trying to do this during the stream, but nobody wanted to play. Nobody wanted to do it. We sat, we sat in the lobbies for like five minutes waiting for waiting for enough players, but they're just like, nah, I'm good. I just want to be on the boots on the ground. That's what I want to do. I just want to not be a Starfighter, because that's just boring, apparently. Have you tried Galactic Starfighter in the Old Republic yet? No. Jeez, that's like a whole different game. Is it? Yeah, it, that very well could have just been its own game. That's how much detail I put into it. Because the last time I did anything Starfighter related in the Old Republic, it was not great. It was the rail shooter, right? Yeah. I mean, I, I don't think it's terrible. It's just not as good as it's the not, Starfighter. Right, and that's the thing. is that like It was a rail shooter, which was kind of interesting. But at yeah. the same time, like there's no point to it because you just kind of point and shoot. It's a cool time waster. It's like a mini game. Yeah, it's it's kind of neat to do like once or twice, but it's not something that you want to grind. Yeah, you don't want to have to grind it if you don't have to. I've I've done it. I've done it like once or twice. And I'm like, oh, okay, I'm not doing this anymore. But I think like when I first discovered, it, I'm like, oh, this is kind of cool. And I did more missions. And it's just like, oh, it's the same thing, just with different scenery. Pretty much. So that's kind of what killed it for me with that. But I mean, if the if the galactic is different, I might try that. It's, is that, it's that's all the, PvP. I was gonna say that's one of the PvPs, right? Yeah. I'm a little bit okay with doing that. Uh, you know, uh, you you might wanna you might wanna go take out those other two targets because okay. if the Y wing like your health for oh, the wow. Y wings okay. is at the top and they're almost dead. I did not notice that. So, so I'm glad you pointed that out. Thank you, sir. I kind of figured since you're just like, oh, I'm just gonna go around here and shoot everything that isn't my objective. I'm just like, uh, buddy. <laughs> I mean, I want to fix this. I mean, you know, there was there, the turrets were just there, so I just took a few out while I was there. We got more friends, more friends to shoot. The, the Empire is trying to stop your bombers from blowing up their star destroyer. Well, that's a good point. Is there, anybody on, is there any TIE Fighters on him? There might be a couple TIE Fighters. They wouldn't really highlight those. Oh, that's okay. That's a that's a companion Y-Wing there. No, not like a companion duel, but you know what I mean. Huh, huh, <laughs> I never played it. Ooh. I know, right? Going. I'm going. Hey, I never played, Bye, Dan. I never played Skyrim either, so... Hey, now they're alive. So, this is... Everyone's got those games that we haven't played that people are like, What? You haven't played X? I mean, Skyrim, you can do this. Oh, you can? I, That's a, out, of, I, out of all of the Elder Scrolls games, probably unpopular opinion, morning. I think Oblivion was the best game. I wouldn't know. Never played that one either. I wish... People who are doing the uh, Project Sky Oblivion would finish. Sky uh, Oblivion. Effectively, it's importing the content from Oblivion into Skyrim. Oh, uh, okay. Less so that it, more so rebuilding the entirety of Oblivion using Skyrim assets. Oh, that's interesting. Um, Think of it like updating Oblivion. Yeah. All right. Because Bethesda was originally going to remake it, and then they stopped because everyone's like, Skyrim, red, red, red. That was a reason. Why is this guy just dogfighting me? Stop it. You're, you're in a dogfight. I don't care. Or four. Meow? Meow. Hey, there you go. Restoration, you're clear to attack. Everyone else, pull back. Not 
looking at the same burning star destroyer? Imperial protocol is to jump away to a safe location. Those ships are headed straight for Theed. They're gonna attack the city. Everyone get to Theed as quickly as you can. We may have the means to stop this. We'll have to do. Anyone know your way around machines? I do. Go with me. Uh... Feed has a defense system. Something we can use to stop the Empire. But the storm has damaged power relays across the city. Until they're repaired, we can't activate anything. Split up. Repair the relays. When you're done, regroup at the palace. Got it? Yeah. Got it. What are we activating? Something that'll stop the Empire. What's your name, soldier? Del Mico. Del, Imperial reinforcements are converging on this sector. We can stop them, but I need you to reactivate those relays. Now we're playing as Leia. We'll have to do more of that next time on Cantina Club. Okay.